feet. Wow, Brett, did he break the world record yet? <laughs> you know, this guy jumping two feet is the equivalent of a human jumping like 50 feet. Hey, forget the science experiment. This could be a whole new rodeo event. Oh yeah, frog roping. You know, there's only one rodeo event that matters. Rodeo, rodeo queen. queen. Ugh, you have got to be kidding me. Do you think Taylor's gonna win again? Two years in a row. No, nobody's gonna be looking at Taylor when they get a load of my Hereford steer. Oh, so um, cows can run for rodeo queen too then? Very funny, city girl. No, my steer's gonna take first place in the two-year-old class. Here he goes again. Easy, frog boy. Calf roping. Barrel racing. Rodeo queen. <laughs> Big whoop. I just don't see how anybody could get so worked up over some ancient ritual where they show up their farm animals every year. Freedom! <laughs> Eric! Get him off of me! <laughs> oh no, your face! That's too much! You are such a jerk! <laughs> My frog! Okay, everybody stay back. I have it. I have it. I have it. I have it. Stupid crap! Right there! Grab it! Just approach it slowly! Eric, you're such an idiot. Get up! Come on, little fella. I'm not gonna hurt you. Oh, you're evil. they need a rodeo event to show off animals for. They can see them every day, right here at High River High. I told her not to take off. There's a devil standing on my tail But I don't have to feed him And there's an angel that is tempting me to fail Have a good one. Wait, how come he gets to leave? Because I like him better than you. Oh, I get it. So if you're on the football team, you get special treatment. Take it easy, Seeger. I'm just kidding. So can I go too? Well, if I let you go, then I'll have to let everyone else go. But I'm the only one in detention. Bingo. So, we can hit the diner and you can help me figure out my dial at Dilemma. <laughs> I wish I could help you with your modem grip, but I've got a clarinet lesson. Oh, man, she's talented, too. Please, you've heard me play. Oh, come on, you'll be doing a solo with the orchestra in no time. Have a milkshake for me? Sure. See ya. Haven't you ever heard of playing hard to get? Okay, well, if you're such an expert with girls, whatever happened to you and Taylor? 
All right. Remember that part about her dumping you. I don't get it. Nikki's ten times prettier than Taylor, and she's way more talented, too. So, why isn't she running? Yeah, you're right. See you later, man. Hey, Dory. Sorry I'm late. I had the stupid t tension. Great. It's you. Here, give Eric a hand with this little guy so I can examine him. Hey. hey. How long has he been like this? Uh, he got scratches last week. Oh, barbed wire? Yeah. He just started staggering a few days ago, and uh, this afternoon I found him wandering in circles. Oh, easy, boy. Oh, boy. What? I'm gonna have to look at the rest of your calves. Yep. This one's showing the same symptoms as the other ones. What do you think it is? Well, from the deterioration of their motor skills and their eyesight, I'd say it's some kind of neurological damage. And what causes that? Well, sometimes it's genetic. Yeah, but not if it's happening to all of them at once. You're right. Probably not in this case. Have you checked the water in the creek lately? Yeah. All the time. If it was polluted, we'd know. Well, something on this land is causing this. Well, look, my dad's at the auction in Great Falls all this week. Is there any chance they'll get better by the time he gets back? And this is some of his prime breeding stock. Mm -hmm. Depends what it is that's causing this. Well, I'll check our land tomorrow. Thanks, Dr. Lowe. I'll let you know if I find anything. Oh, good luck, Eric. Thanks. Hey, Eric, um, how many cows do you have? 500 head, and they're cattle, not cows. Okay, and uh, you're gonna just check the whole ranch by yourself? Well, yeah, I'm in charge of the ranch. Oh, come on now. You can't do it alone. You need some help. What, from you? <laughs> you're useless. Well, you know what? You just can't stand it, can you? Look, I'm not even helping you, all right? I'm helping your cow. Cattle. <sighs> you want to be here first thing in the morning, then? Like nine? Try seven. Seven. Okay. Thanks. Hey, over here! Shoot! <laughs> oh. Yo, Nikki. Good luck next week. What are you talking about? Hasn't Griff told you? I've been at clarinet. He signed you up. He did what? The rodeo <laughs> queen pageant. <laughs> Taylor's gonna be so mad that she's actually got some competition this year. <laughs> Griffin! <laughs> Quarter to eight. Yeah, well, I'm on Saturday time. How long has it been since you moved from the city? I thought you would have adjusted by now. Adjusted to what? Little boys putting frogs on my head? I was doing that frog a favor. How? I'm an animal lover. I was letting it stretch its legs. Mostly, I just wanted to see that look on your face. Can I drive it? This beauty has triple neck suspension, okay? It has faster transport speed than anything else on the market. It goes 25 miles an hour. So? So, of course, you can't drive it. Yeah, you're right. At that speed, I might just fall asleep. It's really beautiful out here. Yeah, you should see it in the snow. Is this all your land? Yep. Cool. Oh, yeah, there's a good one. Yeehaw! Let me at you. What's the problem? You 
You did that on purpose. Who, me? Yes, you, just like the last four logs that you hit. That, that, that log? <laughs> The, the fence is down. Well, looks like your cows have been grazing over at your neighbor's. Cattle. Yeah. I, I was kidding. Stupid fence. <laughs> Don't move. I told you not to move, Caitlin. Why do you always do the opposite of everything I say? I do not. You just did. Stay still. Got it. Look. All right, we're gonna have to put something on that. Griffin. Hey, where were you last night? I tried to call you. You signed me up for Rodeo Queen without asking me first. But if you think I'm gonna parade around in a swimsuit or answer stupid questions, look, I'm sorry. Okay. There was this deadline, and, and you were at clarinet. I, I tried to call you, but your dad said you were out. I don't care, Griffin. But you're smarter than Taylor, you're more beautiful, and you'll be the first African-American rodeo queen. I'm not a poster girl for minority rights, and I don't care about being smarter or more beautiful than anyone. I'm sorry. I didn't think you'd be mad. I am mad. It's not cool. And obviously you don't know me as well as you think. You know, you really don't have to do this. I'm perfectly capable you just... of... Ow. So, um, how'd you manage to get out of detention yesterday? I didn't. But with my dad and my brothers away, I've got work to do here, so the coach said I could make up the detention next week. Oh. Thanks. Yep. You think you can make it through the fence without cutting yourself this time? Hey, have you asked your neighbor if he's having problems with his cow? No, we don't have a neighbor. He, uh, went bankrupt. junk. What is it? This old pesticide has probably been leaking into this water hole. Wait, so if your calves have been drinking from here, then... They've been drinking pure poison. Well, they said they'll order another study. It's the mayor's office, guys. It's, it's all paperwork. Well, how long will it take? Well, they said they'd send somebody right away. And how long until it's cleaned up? Hard to say. Could be a few days, could be a few weeks. Weeks? And what's Eric supposed to do until they get it cleaned up, Dory? Well, we'll just keep our eye on the rest of the calves, and let's just hope that we caught it in time. Pesticides leaking into the ground. You fix the fence. So you know the rest of the herd is safe. Now, if you want to call the mayor's office and... Eric. Eric, wait. I have to go back to the ranch. But I... I want to help. How? How are you going to help me, Caitlin? I... I don't know. Um, I can... I can help look after your calves. Yeah, how about calling my dad and telling him what happened? You want to do that? You want to explain to him that the calves that he put me in charge of, that they're sick? You didn't know. 
Those calves have been acting weird for a couple of days. I'm a rancher's son. I should have known. Hey, how's the, uh, how's the rodeo queen campaign coming? Hey, Griff. You like it? Maybe there's a poster competition or something you could enter me in. Okay, okay. Get inside that classroom. Let's chit-chat more chemistry. Whoa there, Lo. Looks like you'll be joining the weightlifting team this year. Funny. Did you talk to your dad? Yep. And? Well, he said if I hadn't have been so busy trying to score touchdowns, I would have noticed that the fence was down. Come on, it, it is not your fault that there are poisonous chemicals leaking into the water. You don't get it, Caitlin. My dad's right. I was supposed to mind those calves. I was supposed to make sure the fence was okay. It's not like, you know, I forgot to do the dishes or something. I know. No, you don't know. Everything is so easy for you. Easy? All I'm trying to say is that I know that you have a lot of responsibilities, all right? You just, you shouldn't blame yourself for everything. Yeah, well, thanks. I guess. I gotta get to class. So, when's the big date? What are you talking about? Well, you and Eric. You were at his ranch all day Saturday. It's all you talked about Sunday, and now you're hanging out in between classes. Hanging out? That is so not true. Next, we drop the zinc into the hydrochloric acid and watch the reaction. And remember, when you combine the chemicals, point the test tube away from everybody else. Now, this is what'll happen if you don't pay attention and get the formula wrong. Now, go ahead and find yourselves a partner and do it right. You want to be a partner? What? Do you want to be my partner? I figured since we're already working over chemicals, we might as well work together over chemicals. <laughs> um, no thanks. What? Uh, suddenly I'm not good enough for you? Come on, Eric, don't take it so personally, all right? Oh, I wasn't taking it personally. I was trying to do you a favor. Well, I don't need any favors from you. Okay, well, fine. Dad. Is it so terrible to, to want the world to see how beautiful and smart and talented your girlfriend is? Well, if you're talking about Nikki, I think the whole world already sees it. I just wanted her to be in that contest. And I know she would have won, too. And now it's all messed up, and I don't even know why. You just told me why. I did? Yeah. Why does it matter so much what the world thinks? Because it does. It's good to be popular, right? Maybe. Depends on what you have to give up to get it. Dory. Uh, how's the calf doing? He died this morning, Caitlin. I'm sorry. I thought you said he was doing better. Well, I thought he was. The others seem to be holding their own. Yeah. Well, I mean, at least now the mayor's office will have to do something, right? Well, one would think. First, we have to get through all the red tape. And meanwhile, what? Just wait for more calves to die? I swear, if people knew about this, there's got to be something we can do. You want to tell Eric, or you want me to do it? Eric! Eric, 
quick, hold on. What? What do you want? Dory told me that um, the calf in the clinic died this morning. My dad is never going to trust me with anything else. They won't even let me anywhere near the stupid mayor in there. I got to do something. No, we have to do something. That's why I brought this. What do you mean? Look, I'll take a picture of your sick calves, and then we can write up a story and get Griffin to run it through his computer. We can put up flyers all over town. And the mayor will have to clean it up before more calves die. You're gonna help me with that? Yeah. Just take me to your cows. Cattle. Whatever. Hey. Thought you weren't talking to me. Are you talking to me? Of course I am. That poster was really mean. I'm sorry. I got the message. Nikki, I didn't mean to insult you with the whole rodeo queen thing. It was actually more about me wanting you to win than you actually winning. I guess it was flattering in a way how much faith you had in me. You know what? What? You could win anything. Sorry. Ooh. Read all about it. Mayor refuses to order cleanup after pesticides are found leaking into the ground. Your health is at risk, and so is mine. See your exclusive photo. You think this is gonna work? Oh, totally. I mean, the mayor promised. You saw his face when we handed him a copy. Yeah, you're right. I just, uh, still want people to see this. Look, I'm gonna make sure that Nikki and Griffin have enough copies, okay? All Oops, right. sorry. I never would have believed I could get this interested in cows. I mean, cattle. Especially Eric's cattle. I thought the only thing he cared about was football. Who knows, maybe it's not gonna be as easy to hate Eric anymore. <laughs> <laughs>